Hello, I'm Brenda Florida, Certified Life Coach, and this is day five of the 12 days of gifts for you. This is my desire for the holiday season to give you these gifts each day. We're going to do a total of 12 and allow yourself to receive this gift, which is really a gift about you for you because that's the gift that really keeps on giving. So each day we've had a little different theme and a little different exercise. Each of them only takes a couple of minutes. So today what I want to give you is the gift of beauty. And you know, we are surrounded by beauty. You have beauty in your home. You have beauty, I'm sure, in your closet with clothes and shoes and jewelry and all kinds of beautiful things. We have all sorts of beauty out in nature all the time. There's art that you may have in your home or that you can see when you're somewhere else or go to a museum. So many beautiful pieces of art. And so I want you just to really think today, really focus, spend some time paying attention to the beauty that you are surrounded by. And I want you to just maybe select three or four things that are really beautiful to you. Actually, over my shoulder there are a couple of things that are especially beautiful to me. One is that Chanel picture. That's a painted um, copy, I guess, reprint. I don't know what you'd call it. They, it. There was a ad for Chanel in the 20s with this image in it. And this artist got permission from Chanel to do uh, canvas prints of them. So I have one thanks to my son and daughter-in-law who gifted that to me. And even the um, martini glasses you can see there over my shoulder. I think those are beautiful. So it can be small things um, or really big things, but I just want you to identify some things. And again, in a way to bring these things out of our unconscious and into a conscious awareness, okay? We pass by beautiful things all the time and we don't even take it in, right? We have no awareness of it, no conscious feeling that's triggered from it. Like I think beauty just has its own feeling. Like when I'm looking at beautiful things, it just gives me a, a feeling, an emotion. You know, it's pleasure, it's could be love, it could be, you know, we could put other words on it, but I just think beauty has kind of its own unique feeling state. And so whatever you want to call it, you can call it pleasure if that feels more, you know, resonant to you or some maybe love really resonates for you when you're looking at something of beauty, maybe it's majesty, something like that, whatever it is, I just want you to take that time today and just consciously feel it. Just give yourself the time and space to just enjoy on a conscious level the beauty that is around you. And that, my friend, will shift your mood for the next several minutes, if not rest of your day. So if you do this several times throughout the day, you'll find, and again, this is why these things are so powerful, even though they're small and they only take a few minutes and you could easily kind of poo-poo it and be like, oh, well, that's, you know, dumb stuff or that's too easy or it's too simple to really make an impact in my life or whatever. But here's the truth. Change is made in our lives much more often by very small steps that are taken regularly than by one leap. And so by taking these small steps and every day for the various reasons that I, you know, given you and my gifts to you to focus on that day, focusing on those things that make you feel really lovely inside that will stack up and start to shift into a really positive pattern for you. Then you've got a habit, a sort of unconscious habit that is serving you. You have this unconscious habit that you just notice beauty everywhere. You notice the fabulous things about who you are. You think really often about the beauty of your body and how magnificent it is. You find ways naturally to create ease in your life. You know, all these things that we've been talking about and they become the unconscious habits instead of the ones that you have down there that we all have um, that create stress or don't really serve us. So today, find those objects of beauty and just enjoy feeling the beautiful feelings of taking the time to appreciate in nature or in the things around you what we have that is beautiful.
I love you. I will see you tomorrow in day six of our 12 days of gifts for you.